Hello, and welcome to SB252, your home for breaking sports news. And I'd like to bring you some breaking news out of the NFL. It was just announced that New York Giants quarterback Eli Manning will be benched this weekend coming up whenever they play against the Oakland Raiders in favor of former Jets quarterback Geno Smith. Now, Geno Smith didn't really have a very good era with the Jets. It was up and down, mostly bad, if you ask most Jets fans. But also, a lot of people have been calling for the rookie Davis Webb, who's still going to be on the bench, but a quarterback that the Giants are developing. Now, this is shocking news for many people, because Eli Manning has started for the New York Giants since 2004, November 21st, 2004 to be specific, whenever he was put on the field in favor of Kurt Warner. So this is definitely something to keep track of. He has started 210 straight games, short of his brother Peyton Manning by a few games, and short of the all-time record for consecutive starts of Brett Favre. He's short of him by 87 games. Now, a, call, a lot of people were calling for the benching of Eli Manning after they lost to the San Francisco 49ers the other week, 31-21. to I really didn't think he should have been benched after that game. I know he's playing bad. I know right now he has seven, inter seven interceptions and eight fumbles this season. The Giants are only averaging 15.6 points per game and 295 yards a game, which makes them one of the worst offenses in football. But Eli Manning has proven to be a leader throughout his entire career. He's missing Odell Beckham this season. He's missing Brandon Marshall, and the offensive line is terrible. I believe that this is more of a coaching failure and a general manager failure. Because under Coughlin, while Eli Manning did not play elite during the regular season, he was definitely an elite quarterback during the postseason. This is a very bittersweet move, especially with me being an Eagles fan. Eli Manning is a professional football player. He is very professional in the way that he carries about himself in the media with the press, with the fans. As a matter of fact, this offseason, Eli Manning wrote back to me. Whenever I wrote to him asking for an autograph request, he actually signed my card and sent it back. So thank you, Eli Manning, for that. So for those reasons, I'm not happy that he's benched. While on the same note, he won two Super Bowls, and Eagles fans had to suffer through that. We had to suffer through two Eli Manning Super Bowls, two shocking victories against the Patriots, and I know there's a lot of people who don't like the Patriots either. I know that. I know a lot of people were happy. But man, man, we suffered through that one. So either way, news out of New York. Thank you for joining us with SB252. And please make sure to keep up with this channel to get your break, breaking news out of the sports world. Thanks.